everybody, it's Corey Saltitude Floyd at Comics and Cosplay, and I'm with Dee Dee Hall. Some of you might know her as this character on the show, uh, uh, Stephen Universe. Oh, yeah, yeah, Stephen yes. Universe. What's and that? you play a. I play a crystal gem called Pearl. Right, right, right. Pretty popular show, pretty popular show. It's literally number one in whatever time slot they throw it on. It's actually one of the best shows out right now. Uh, of course, I am not oblivious to this. Hello, Miss Hall. How are you? How are you? Good. I know. Thank you for having me. <laughs> it's an absolute pleasure. Um, so, when it came to Steven Universe and they first approached you with the character, it was... Uh, how did you go about it? Was this like, was this voice for Pearl the first reaction, or did it go through a few trials and tribulations? Well, it definitely, it definitely did. She was, uh, she started out, I think, a little bit more reserved, and then, um, how do you say, uh, Pearl is simply a, an extension or more exaggerated version of my own voice, so uh, oftentimes I will be talking to my own children at home. Um, perhaps scolding them, maybe just showing them some love, but but I definitely, Pearl definitely comes out, that voice definitely comes out, and uh, it's hard to distinguish the difference between the two. But, um, you know, when I first auditioned, it was one of many auditions that I had gone out for, and uh, I was just so pleased to know that Pearl was a singing character as well, because that's sort of where I, I started, I started as a singer. So, um, I, I just am so thrilled to be part of such a beautiful show that is affecting so many people in such a positive way all over the world. But I'm uh, happy to be here because it's coming to the hospital. And, with the, and the music is, so, is some of the most original music on TV today. Yes. So, and, and that's all to do with Rebecca. <laughs> Rebecca Sugar. Shout out to Rebecca Sugar, the brilliant, <laughs> the brilliant yeah. mind behind the show. Yes, and her Crooniverse, of course. <laughs> Of course. Uh, do you and the other cast members, are there all individual recording sessions or every once in a while do they have have you in the same studio at the same time? Because sometimes they do, sometimes there are shows that do group recordings and, so, and it comes off well and sometimes it's just edited well. Um, I'm sure there's a, there's a healthy mixture of both. Okay. Um, uh, because of geography, some of the uh, actors with other places and so right. they've got to be um, they've got to be phoned in, not phoned in. That's not a <laughs> that's a negative connotation. But what I mean is, um, when I was on tour, for instance, I was on tour with a show called If Then, and we traveled all over the country. And because I wasn't in California, where it's where it's most of the, the group recordings happened, right. um, they were. I was literally on the phone in a recording studio Excuse wherever you? I was, in different places I was in the country. And uh, they were on the phone with Rebecca and her team, and so I would get voice direction okay, from her, and then also just record at the studio, and they would just patch me in, okay. magically. So um, when I am home, when I am in California, I'm able to do group records, which is uh, is a preference of mine, and, and, and most of us. We love being in the studio together recording. It's just, you can't, you can't, uh, uh, Recreate that sort of group dynamic when all, we're all there together in chemistry, um, just like you know, bouncing off of each other energy wise. So I prefer these recordings, but, but they definitely do record individually when they have to. Okay. So, but when you but when you did your uh, when you did music, were you were you in California or were you still on the road still? Um, I believe I sang most. I, I believe all, I sang all of the songs. Uh, in okay, because yeah. I was about to say, because you're on the road doing doing the show, and you got to turn around and do this entirely different piece of music. No, but it's but it's done. It's it's done. Mm -hmm. so okay. It's even done before, where they do sing from wherever they are. Now, in the middle of these juggling acts, you picked up a few voice acting awards, didn't you? I was. Well, 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 you, you had you had a few big back to back even. Oh really? <laughs> I, I can't. I can't recall. <laughs> But what an honor it was, even just to be nominated. 
Now, uh, we actually recently uh, asked uh, another voice actor at Anime Next, how would you feel next year? How would you feel in the upcoming years as voice actors started getting a bit more live recognition, especially on televised events like the Emmy Awards and so forth? Um, I am certainly on board for that. <laughs> uh, that would be so wonderful to be recognized, um, you know, with your peers. And, I mean, I, I, I don't only voice act. In fact, voice acting came a little bit later in my life, uh, in my career. I started out singing and acting. You want to be somebody, you want to go somewhere, you've got to wake, wake up, up and pay attention. attention. All right? Wake up and pay attention. Ooh, and she did the clips. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so, so acting, and singing, and stage performance as well, um, I sort of like to dabble in, in all of them. And voice acting is definitely, is definitely one of my favorites just because um, I get to I get to be a different person, a different character. Without the wardrobe change. Uh, without the wardrobe change. <laughs> In my PJs, if you will. Um, but uh, not to say that we don't uh, take on different characters with stage, stage acting and, and film and TV. Uh, but voice acting, I don't know, I just am having so much fun with it. I, I really hope that I can uh, lend my voice to other characters in, in the near future. Well, look, trust me, we don't want you to stop anytime soon. We're very, we're very, very happy. Oh, well, that's Yeah, we're nice very happy. We are so happy that we actually have a little gift for you. Oh, oh, a present. Oh, so lovely. Thank you. This is, actually, <laughs> this is actually from the good folks at Busload of Penguins. So thank you, Busload of Penguins. <laughs> this is, I'm deeply touched. Thank you. This is so cool. Get it? Penguins are cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, this is Corey Salter, Chief Floyd. Oh, the oh, the hugs. I love At it. Philadelphia Comics and Cosplays, we'll see you around, okay?